When installing vibrating wire piezometers, an initial reading at the zero point is very important for the accuracy of the subsequent readings. This reading should be taken aside just before installation. To perform this initial reading, you will need a vibrating wire piezometer with a standard filter, a bucket of flat water, and a vibrating wire sensor readout such as RST's VW2106. Before taking the initial reading, the filter stone should be saturated. Turn the piezometer upside down and remove the end assembly which is held in place with an internal o-ring. Submerge the inverted piezometer in the bucket of flat water which has been sitting for a day or into a bucket of dear water. While keeping the piezometer submerged, slowly replace the filter housing onto the inverted piezometer end allowing the water to be forced out through the filter center. With a low pressure range piezometer, 0.1 MPa or less, it is recommended that the vibrating wire readings be taken with a vibrating wire readout box while the filter housing is being pushed slowly into place. This ensures that the sensor does not overrange. To maintain the filter saturation prior to installation, the piezometer should be stored in the bucket of water until it is ready to be installed downhole. Once saturated, take the initial reading with no load applied. This is typically done immediately before installation and at a constant ambient temperature and barometric pressure after 20 to 30 minutes of equilibration. Record the vibrating wire reading in B units plus the temperature. For low pressure piezometers or where a barometric correction will be used, make sure to record barometric pressure at the time of the initial reading. Initial temperature and barometric readings are required to apply correction factors. It is not recommended to use the initial values shown on the included calibration sheet because the condition at your site will vary from our manufacturing facility. RST highly suggests that readings should be taken during installation including lowering of piezometer downhole, a pre-grout water test, grouting and while the grout sets. These readings can be taken with a vibrating wire readout or data logger and the data will show if the sensor was overpressurized during the installation. For more information on this topic and related information, please contact RST Technical Support at support at rstinstruments.com or call 604-540-1100. Thanks for watching.